Okay, cool. All right, so now we're gonna get into Flight Boy Nice. All right, so I do wanna hear the song before we got distracted by, um, by Uzi. Um, gladly, um, I didn't even know that dropped. <coughs> um, I do wanna hear this, where is it? Where is it, where is it? You would think it'd be at the top. The fuck is this song called again? I think so. Um, ghetto. Okay. Uh, did he take it down? No way. Okay. Okay. Let's see, um, because I was going to react to this, and I've been hearing about it for the last week since it dropped, so it's like, let's just... Let's see. <laughs> like that's like low-key just like yeah you know, i don't know what max's take was i don't even know why like why are like i don't even know i don't know i don't know <laughs> okay. max literally is max not a streamer that collab with lazy power like is that not a thing has that not been going on for like years Chip B and KSI, for example. Um, I don't know why it's a problem now. And have YouTubers not been in fucking um, artists' music videos? Bro. <laughs> this is not, this is, this has something to do with the entire topic itself. The main topic is this video right here. The, my point. This right here. This right here. I just heard he got shot. I know. Is, is yeah. it not a... I just heard he got shot in his face. Yes. No I mean, it, it isn't a collab, but like, bro, you know? Uh, Baby, now you can see me. Still, I'm on the spectrum, like, like, the same thing. Like, 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 Aiden Ross was literally in Cardi's music video, I think. I think I remember that happening. Uh, you can't see what I'm thinking, you can't even read me. I would've fro but now you won't be me. Pop shit. Fuck nigga, look at me, now you can see me. Fuck nigga, look at me, now you won't be me. Pop shit, put in their face like 3D. Fuck nigga, stop by that point, you ain't ET. Chop out the stove, got that zip at the BP. Hold us back, then I fuck nigga need me. You can't see what I'm thinking, you can't even read me. I would've fro when I do it, you ain't leave me. Like you gon' stop me from popping this over with. Punching my verse, I need have to go over it. Baby Drake in the book bag, I had a scroller it. Inform me on the lid, I had a nobody. These ain't my debit cards, they might be your wallet. Stall over, I'm the one whipping, I ain't a co-pilot. You know you ain't gon' stop, that ain't even your body. Come to the trench, show you shit you don't know about. Nigga ass sight, nigga think he a robot. Step back, when I swing the torch, it gon' blow out. Ran out of smoke, so like I ain't brand Mozart. Nigga think I'm down, drop a heat, it get more hot. Chop out that low, ain't even know that was your spot. Look at me now, fuck, nigga, I got more guap. Look at me now, fuck, nigga, I can drill. Fuck. Look at me, look at me, look at me. Okay. Okay. Um. Now what's uh? Like this. 
got laser career. No yeah. offense. But laser then making a song and putting out a music video with Unghetto Matthew up his career. We should all know that. With this underground scene that we got right now, hot takes is a huge thing for sure. Because we all get crazy for our favorite art. <laughs> but when it comes to right now, hot takes. Oh my god. This is the craziest thing I've ever seen in my goddamn life. He has to be. Okay. Never mind. Just not gonna say anything. You have to fucking be stupid. You, you just gotta. You you have to be cooked. You have to be cooked. It's, it's just a huge thing. Because sure. we all get crazy for our cooked. favorite artists. But when it comes to underground, these dudes will say anything. I might say something crazy. And I gotta catch myself. You know? Y'all probably wonder, okay, why are you saying that? Because there's somebody that's been stuck. I've already been cooked for a lot of things in my life on TikTok. <laughs> so, yeah. And I gotta catch myself, you know? Y'all probably wondering, okay, why are you saying that? Because there's somebody that's been standing out the most when it comes to hot takes or just speaking about the underground in general. It's been a long time since I spoke about him, but my boy Max has been going crazy. He's been doing his own thing, you know? And I can only give him respect for that because he also helped me out too. He watches my videos here and there, so I respect him for that, you know? But more the story, I've been seeing a lot of Max on my timeline because he's been saying some crazy stuff. Like I seen something where he said that Ian and King Carson have surpassed Tyler the Creator and Tupac. Y'all know something where I didn't see this at all. Okay. Yeah. He said okay. that Ian and King Carson have surpassed okay. Tyler the Creator and Tupac. And y'all know how Twitter is. They hear something like that, there's gonna be tons of people trying to spread their opinions. But people don't seem to understand that Max is a huge streamer, but he's always gonna have that underground mentality because that's all he listened to. You know what I'm saying? And a lot of yeah. people don't know there's tons of people like Max. The whole scene is full of that. You know what I'm saying? The stuff they be hearing Max say, that is nothing new. There's tons of people that absolutely think that Ian and King Carson are better than a lot of mainstream rappers. Like, seriously. Like, this don't sound crazy, but there's a lot of people that think Cardi's better than Lil Wayne. Like, they would that tell you that, and they would have a straight face about it. Because we're not only in a different time, but you gotta understand, the underground is a cult, so we ride for our artists way differently than as these rap caviar fans. And you really not gonna understand what I'm saying unless you're in our scene, if that makes sense. Because y'all know, it's been a minute since I spoke about Laser, too. The last video I made about him, I was talking about how he was going through a lot, and people didn't understand that. He lost his accounts. He wasn't able to post those reels and those TikToks like he usually do, because he was banned on all of his accounts for some reason and it really wasn't that. looking good hold on let me grab a straw real quick uh, i'm sorry guys i just i gotta you know i, I gotta grab a straw real quick because he canceled the tour that he was supposed to go on. But I heard things are getting way better for him. He's actually about to go on tour soon and that his numbers look decent. He's making decent quality music for his fans. And I already told y'all how I feel about Laser. But the good thing about what Laser does is that we all know he's gonna be. I predict to everyone. Thank you, thank you. I don't think I've ever gotten an add on one of these And their grandma That's will be so using insane. this Chrome extension by 2025. Bro, I do really not, not care. Google cheat codes. And I already told y'all how I feel about Laser. But the good thing about what Laser does is that we all know he's going to be consistent, okay? No matter what. And recently, I seen something trending where Laser had dropped a song with Unghetto Matthew, all right? And if y'all don't know who that is, he's a YouTuber or something like that, slash rapper. He's been making music for a minute, but yeah, he's mainly a YouTuber. And we all know how Laser is. He's just trying to get some money. So he made a song with this guy, and eventually he dropped it onto YouTube. And the only reason I'm bringing this up is because Max had reacted to it. And he had a lot of stuff to say. Because he didn't just say the song was good or bad. And trust me, you already know the major role that Max plays into Laser's career. There's a lot of people that would tell you this laser wouldn't be where he is right now if it wasn't for max so instead of me chatting we actually just gonna watch this clip right like for, really like really because wasn't laser them already doing his thing before he even met max so like, don't don't get me wrong like is that not Laser has been around longer than you even knew the nigga like. What's the first what's the first song I heard about Laser? Um let's see. Uh like 
it was one of these like i know what i don't, I don't know what song exactly bro but like he got popular i swear it was either him or somebody else off of one of his music videos namely tony dim i think went to like i don't really know exactly which one but bro he was popping kind of before he even met the nigga max so I don't know how I feel about that take, but we gonna move on. Oh, the major role that Max plays into Laser's career. There's a lot of people that will tell you this. Laser wouldn't be worth Don't like it. I will say it's bad. I'm just letting you know. It ain't no hard. We actually just gonna watch this clip. If I don't like it, I will say it's bad. I'm just letting you know. It ain't no hard feelings. I got a lot of respect for you. You feel me? I used to look at your channel for all the public interview I did. No balls. Facing boys. Let's see if it's good. Oh. All right, I'm about to say something crazy. Yeah, One, this, beat, this song's not bad. This song's not bad. It's cool. The beat is not my vibe. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's just some basic, like, you feel me? Understandable. Like, I'll get on Matthew part, not bad. Man. Laser shit sound. But let me give y'all my take. I think, sh like, this. Cut laser career. No offense. But laser then making a song and putting out a music video where Unghetto Matthew up his career. I'm just keeping the butt. That's how I see it. Okay. That's how I see it. It's okay. none against him. For example, if I were to hop on Lace Max, that song would be nowhere where it is. It's the fact. It's something about it. I, I, I don't know how to explain it. Yo, imagine Cardi was to put out a I song with sure. Tyson X. You get what I'm saying? <laughs> bro, yeah, I gotta understand what I'm saying, bro. I understand a little bit. Okay. Now, it's a little different because I make music, but it's like the whole, like, it's the image brand integrity thing. Mm. Like, rappers are looked at as cool. So he thinking Sorry, like a the tag is throwing me off what i'm saying bro i understand a little Sorry. bit okay now it's a little different because i make music but it's like the whole like it's the image brand integrity thing mm. like rappers are looked at as cool so he thinking like a manager or something and then it's like damn i'm hopping on with it who got stink allegations like bro let's keep it a buck bro you know what i'm saying that's just how i see it. and i think like this hurts his careers a little bit cardi career going triple after that i wouldn't say it's nah i don't know nah i don't know like imagine i hopped on the song with the eta song with ian i feel like that make ian look great not you know what i'm saying yeah like he came on my stream just hit it's gonna sound crazy but he will lose his image his aura and now he like a streamer hopping on a song with him imagine i was featured on his album you get what i'm saying it'd be like i get it like what you got a streamer on your album that's yeah. how i see it personally now once again you don't no. gotta agree with me but that's just how i see it that's how i see it. i'm not saying i'm right i just tell you how i think I never, you don't gotta agree with me. You could be, you, I could be right, I could be wrong. I don't really give up. See, what Max was saying, I don't think it was horrible at all. I really think that he just forgetting that laser is. See, what Max was saying. And then there's this one guy, Nahi Chat. Like, I don't think it. Why if he made a song in DDG? Um, DDG doesn't count. <laughs> I feel like DDG doesn't count. In a way, DDG does not count. Because he was either... I don't. I can't remember if he was an artist before he was a YouTuber or a YouTuber before he was an artist. But bro, DDG does not count. Because DDG has proved... Nobody watches DDG. Let's be real. Let's be real. Let's be real. Let's be for real, for real. We only listen to DDG for his music. Let's be for real. Let's be for real. Who is name name five DDG view videos? <laughs> name five DDG videos. Gun in your head right now. Name five D DDG videos. <laughs> you know what I mean? Don't nobody watch that. I think. <laughs> we bro, tell me I'm wrong when we basically know DDG for his music at this point. That's not even a valid point, bro. That's not even was a horrible at all. I really think that he just forgetting that Laser is a whole different type of artist. I don't know how many times I told y'all in videos that Laser doesn't care. He's a money guy. That's all he wants. It's just money. He don't really care about the rap and stuff. He don't care about none of this. He just wants money. All those collab videos, him doing 20 v ones and all that. I don't think Laser is ever going to be the artist to get deep into his image, okay? And him doing that is somewhat working for him because he getting cosigns from like Rod Wave and all these mainstream people. So people know who he is. It's not like it's tarnishing his career now i do think him collabing with just youtubers in general and just making random content all of that now i do think him collabing with just youtubers in general are you serious are you dead ass i have to watch this at some point i gotta watch this at some point oh my god and just making random content all of that 
man. It might get annoying here and there. You know what I'm saying? If he just keeps doing it. But one song with Unghetto Matthew, I don't think that's gonna hurt his career. I think yeah, people are just gonna move past it like another song and just be like, yeah, Laser just did that because he just wanted the bread. Literally, I think that's what people are gonna look at it. Cause I don't even think Laser Team even care either. I don't even think Laser Team even care about it. I think cause it's like, Laser, they, it's not a big deal. But if it was, if it's cause it's like he's already shown what his like, you know what I mean? What his plan is and what his goal is and shit. And if it was anybody else, it'd be different, obviously. But if because his because people know Laser is like, it's it's that way because people know Laser, obviously. So, I want him to do it. Just I think if it, was, if it was anybody else, niggas would truly be upset. But I think um, I don't know. Um, you know, Laser's just that kind of person, I guess. You know what I mean? And as he's, he, he, as Dude keeps mentioning in the video, nigga only, you know, nigga wants money. You know what I mean? making money and providing him music. That's it. But I've seen on TikTok somewhere again. that this clip actually you know I mean? went a little viral of him talking about Laser. Oh, and for goodness. some reason, there's a lot of people that don't agree with Max. On Ghetto Matthew has something either. to say. He said, mind you. I mean, I see his like certain points, but I don't agree with him like the whole way. But I see his points. For rappers to make songs with Kanye when he was a producer. Let's I remember this, this vid in the future. Oh, this is by him. Black Hardy mode. I don't know why he's comparing himself with Kanye. I don't yeah, know that's why kind he did that. But, uh, but yeah, somebody. You know? I don't know why he's comparing himself. I guess I get your point. Let's remember this video. <laughs> but don't ever compare yourself mode. to Kanye, nigga. I don't know why he's comparing himself with Kanye. I don't know why he did that. But uh, yeah, somebody said you're not Kanye though. Like, that's crazy, but. <laughs> Yeah, but Max still hated um, him. Someone else said, "Why we made a song with DDG?" Nah, he uh, chatted. Put my point on this. Laugh emoji. On Ghetto Math, he knows more about music than Max. Someone else said, "This definitely facts." Not gonna lie. Someone else said, "Not gonna lie, this is true." Imagine if Cardi hopped on a song with KSI or Kai. But it's different since Laser is on a come up and Cardi is already looked at as very highly. I kind of see what he's saying, but On Ghetto Math, you actually good, so it's different from Kai. Yeah. Someone else said he's chatting. On Ghetto Math, you actually makes music for real. He's not just no random YouTuber. He's more in tune than Max. Somebody Somebody else said this is the same kid that called Tyler trash and said that destroy lonely better than Tupac. On um, Ghetto Matthew is one of the few YouTubers that actually make good music, in my opinion. He listens to yeah, that. I kind of can't Tupac. take Max's um, Matthew. opinion seriously concerning he said. I know I don't know if he was being serious because I haven't seen the clip, but I I just I don't <laughs> I just can't take Max's point serious just because like he called Tyler trash. So. Put destroy lonely over Tupac and Tyler. Matthew is one of the few YouTubers <laughs> that actually make good music, in my opinion. He listens to Netspan. Nobody's thinking about that song. Yeah, nobody's thinking that deeply about the song. I ain't gonna lie. Oh, chatting, I ain't gonna lie. Complete different, bro. Do you see how much bro drops? And that is true. Laser is consistent, so I don't think nobody really gonna care about just one song. Max Mad Jealous, he hanging around with other content creators. Sound like jealousy. Now, I'm gonna be real with y'all for the people that saying that Max is jealous. I don't think that's the case at all. I just seen that jealous Max is hanging out with Ian. One song. Max Mad Jealous, jealous he hanging around with Why would he be jealous? Lasers, nigga. Ian hangs out with other people. Nigga, Ian hung out with fucking Chief Keith. Like, you, you think you do, you, bro? You, you, now y'all niggas is thinking too deeply, bro. I don't think Max gives a fuck. I really don't. Yeah, I don't think it's that deep. Sound like, like jealousy. Now I'm gonna be real with y'all for the people that saying that Max is jealous. I don't think that's the case at all. Right. I just seen that Max is hanging out with Ian and Yee and I all just of these said other that, rappers. Yeah. Why would he be tripping on laser? Someone else said he hang on laser, getting this. his first ticket into mainstream. That Unghetto Matthew song is his. I don't think. See, this is a weak point because I don't think Max gives a fuck that much. Best feature to date and a song good too. Who what are we doing? About bro? The persona. We want good. Now we trying to make it jealousy. Now what you're saying is cool, but saying that he might go mainstream because of this song, okay. dude. What are y'all talking about? This is not a ticket to the mainstream. Yeah. Him collabing with Unghetto Matthew. Are we serious, bro? No <laughs> offense to the YouTuber. Don't get me wrong, but like, you think that he's gonna go mainstream because he made a song with a YouTuber? Like I said, yeah. it's a lot of y'all that's forgetting how Laser is. It's the same guy that said he wanted to be a streamer and a YouTuber and all that. He not yeah. deep into the whole image thing. He don't care about personas or nothing like that.
that he just want to be himself. I don't think Laser ever think about longevity or the future. And it's crazy because it ain't even been a year yet. So we don't even know what Laser got coming next or what he's going to do next year or something like that. And I made this video because the person that had this opinion and said that Laser is kind of ruined his career wasn't just anybody. A lot of people forget that Max literally helped Laser blow up. So when I heard what Max was saying, he kind of... That's really untrue, but go ahead. A lot of people forget that Max literally helped Laser blow up. So when I, I mean slightly, saying, yeah, and helped him get like some, 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 you know, some shit, some little shit. But like, nigga, Den was already coming up before he even met Max. I don't know what. He keeps going back to that point like it's valid, but it's like, nigga, Den was already blown up before him. It's like, what are we doing? What are we doing? What are we doing? Like, honestly, what are we doing? He kind of was trying to say that he's taking the wrong direction with his career. Even though the numbers might look decent or whatever, he dropped like, Nigga, you trying to make it seem like Max put Dim on. Like, nigga, no. Dim was already blowing up before then. You can't really argue with that, <laughs> but I think Max is thinking about the future. And when you see all these artists like Nespin, Osama Sun, all of these people that's kind of like, and then you look at a person like Laser, you kind of get this mixed point of view. But I appreciate my... But I think Max is thinking about the future. And when you see all these artists like Nespin, Osama Sun, all of these people that's kind of like, and then you look at a person like Laser, you kind of get this mixed point of view. But I appreciate my supporters for sending me comments. Is thinking about the future. And when you see all these artists like Nespin, Osama Sun, all of these people that's kind of like, and then you look at a person like Laser, you kind of get this mixed point of view. I can't really argue with that, but I, mean, I, I can't think Max say that Nespin counts, but we move on. <laughs> I can't see how Nespin counts in this situation. You know, uh, like Nets, we're not about to compare Nets back and Laser. Like, we're not about to. Uh, it's thinking about the future. And when you see all these artists like Nets Spin, Osama Sun, all of these people that's kind of like, and then you look at a person like Laser, you kind of get this. You, it's different of because Laser has actually fucking collabed with fucking YouTubers and, and streamers and shit. And Osama and fucking. Um, uh, goddamn, what's the name? Haven't. The view, but I appreciate my supporters for sending me that TikTok. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about this whole situation. Do y'all feel like Max was jealous? Do y'all think he's speaking facts? Let me know. But yeah, make sure y'all follow my Twitch. Yeah, I was just like... Just... I don't know. I don't know. I mean, I don't even know what they are. Does that mean what they are? I don't know, bro. Uh, it's hard to tell what Max what fucking meant by that. It's like... It's truly fucking just a stupid point that he made twice at that. Um, I I don't know how I, I like. I don't understand how a person could be so wrong about <laughs> about fucking Ken Carson being better than Tyler the Creator. But uh, anyway, shout out Doozy and shout out Max and shout out Laser. Don't know what, uh, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know anymore, I don't think I know, I don't think I really know, to be honest. Uh, <laughs> I'm really trying to figure out what the fuck Max was on when he said that, but we, we move. Um, uh, damn, nigga, full screen, thank you, alright. Um, yeah, shout out, shout out everybody. Shout out to you.